Okay, today we're going to look at how we can sort data, and we're going to look at how we're sorting data in a list. In particular, we're looking at the bubble sort. First off, we're going to get a range of cards, and we're going to get them all shuffled, all shuffled, so there is no order to our cards. Let's have a look. Yes, that's a nice, nice shuffle there. So I'm going to start off by putting my nine down, my four down, my five down, my six, my ten and my ace. Now the idea is that we use the bubble sort to get this list into a logically sorted um, ascending um, order. Now uh, ace we're going to call one in this case um, and as you can see the largest item in our list is the number 10. So the 10 ultimately needs to get to there and that's what's going to happen with the bubble sort. The largest cards bubble to the end or bubble to the top should we say and our list will get sorted coming down through there. Now, our first pass as we go through our list, we take two items of data and we do a comparison. We go one and 10, 10 being bigger, we make no change. We then take the 10 and the six. This time, the 10 is obviously or clearly bigger than the six, so we make a change, move them back. We then take our next two cards, the 10 and the five, and yes, we're right, the 10 is going to bubble to the top. 10 and four, 10 moves to there, the four moves back. The 10 and the nine, comparison, the 10 moves to there. That's our first pass. And like we can see now, the 10 is in order. In fact, luckily enough, so is the nine, but we haven't got an order through these cards. So we're gonna start our pass again. One and six, perfectly fine, move back. Six and five, well, the six is bigger, obviously, than the five. It bubbles ahead, goes back. We take the six and the four. The six is clearly bigger. The six moves to there as it bubbles up and we're starting to get something that looks a lot more ordered. We can do the six and the nine, but there's no change, and there's no change with the nine and the 10. So 10, nine, six. Okay, so we've got another pass coming up. One and five, perfectly fine. Go back. Five and four, well, the five is clearly bigger than the four, so it bubbles up to the top. Five and six, no change. Six and nine, no change. Nine and 10, no change. We now have an ordered list. We're ascending up through. We've bubbled to the top the biggest items. 10, 9, 6, 5, 4 and 1. So that is the bubble sort.